So many of Kaylee Humphrey's greatest moments have come while wearing the maple leaf, something she's willing to give up to compete for the United States. Humphrey sued Bobsleigh Canada for refusing to release her from the team. Today, in a Calgary courtroom, she lost her case. She's obviously very disappointed with the decision and know that the actions that they're taking are simply to hamper uh, Kaylee's ability to compete for the United States. After funding and training Humphreys for more than a decade, Bobsleigh Canada doesn't want to let her go. We want Kaylee in our program. Um, Kaylee is uh, obviously going to be uh, a threat in the next Olympics and, and we, there's nothing more that we like to see other than Canadians standing on the podium. More than a year ago, Humphreys filed a harassment complaint with Bobsleigh Canada, alleging head coach Todd Hayes emotionally and verbally abused her. This week, an internal investigation found her allegations were not substantiated. Our athletes in the current pool um, have clearly been outspoken that he's um, the one that they want in the program. Our team culture is something we've been working on specifically in the last two years. Uh, it's something that, that actually Todd brought in himself to, to kind of build that team atmosphere. Canada. But today's ruling isn't stopping Humphreys or her legal team. They plan on appealing the court decision. Under international rules, Humphreys requires release by the end of September to be able to compete for the U.S. this season. We'll be looking for a waiver of the release uh, requirement, uh, you know, because of the grossly unsportsmanlike positions being taken by Bobsleigh Canada. Humphrey. Humphrey still plans to attend a U.S. training camp as a guest this week. Devin Haru, CBC News, Toronto.